Today, it's my pleasure to present to you Villa Heart, our new exclusive listing from Dumelia. Actually, one of the most exciting listings that we've had recently. A brand new villa just came to the market for only 4,950,000 euros. Frontline golf with sea and Gibraltar views and the most amazing qualities that can only be compared to a villa of 10 million euros or above. We've got six bedroom suite, 820 square meters of interior built, plus 220 square meters of porches and terraces, and a bunch of unique wow factors. Really looking forward to showing it to you in all its details. So the question is, are you ready? Let's go! As we approach the house from the street, we get a view of the back facade of the property, which is like a shell wrapping the house around and protecting it from people looking inside. Here, we've got 24-hour security with cars patrolling all the streets. The checkpoint of the security is just up the street, 10 meters away. Then, we also have gates which close at night and work from the remote control. As we go inside, we have a nice passerella leading to the main entrance nice detail of the water feature beautiful olive tree and on the other side we have a carport for one or two cars for your daily use in case you don't want to go driving into the garage the main entrance door opens up with a code and we're in immediately we have one of the nicest features of this house which is this andalusian patio rarely you find this detail in modern properties and i just love how the developer managed to integrate this classical spanish detail in a modern villa it's a beautiful thing that is appreciated in your everyday living the patio provides fantastic airflow and extra lightning to the living room the dining and the kitchen which flow around it in summer opening up the windows you create a very nice current and you don't need to use the AC at all. It's completely outdoor space. The rainwater is collected through the gaps on the floor. Beautiful. To my right, we have the living room, which has very nice proportion and size. We've got big, chunky sofa pieces. You can just tell how comfortable they are and still plenty of space to walk around. You can play with the furniture if you wanna have it face to the TV or turn it all around and face the garden full domotic system that controls everything in the house. You've got climate control, shutters, lightning, different scenes, and all of this connected directly into the iPad or iPhone. Also, spectacular lightning that you can move along and focus on different spots of the living room to create that fantastic atmosphere. Lighting in this house is very special, but we're gonna leave it to the end and show it to you with some nice shots, which is when you're gonna appreciate it the most. So wait for that. Also, we've got plenty of hidden storage space here and all around the house for all your daily stuff. So you can actually keep it all hidden and live in the house like it is seen in the video. We've got high quality sugar windows and blinds in every single window. Massive suspended covered porch protects the inside from direct sunlight. Actually, the furniture is very high level and the furniture, same as everything else that you see in this house, is included in the price of 4,950,000 euros. And as we go along the tour, you will see that everything has been thought through and finished to the last detail. There's nothing, absolutely nothing missing. So you can just move in here from day number one and enjoy the property to the maximum. No headaches, like this barbecue. Check it out. Finished to the last detail you've got fridges over here gas cooker this is big boy stuff plenty of space to have that amazing time with your family and friends the pool area is really welcoming you've got the chaise longs over here the pool is salt water and what a beautiful view once again you've got the golf course with all these trees, the sea, Gibraltar, it's a very unique and a very different view. House is southwest orientation, so you get sun all day round, especially after 12. 
the space out here, it's so open, but at the same time so private. I just love it. And looking back, we can appreciate the main facade of the property. Very massive porches on both levels give it a lot of character. They're around 20 meters long each and five meters deep, which gives a lot of shade and make it very practical to enjoy in the sun heat. And a really cool opening in the ceiling above the jacuzzi on the first floor. Overall, a very modern, and unique facade, stands out a lot. I really like how the developer managed to combine the modern architecture together with the most practical aspects of a villa in Marbella. Also, by the way, the villa has energy efficiency rating A, which if you're into that, you'll know how complicated it is to find in Marbella. Now we'll step inside the house from the other side. We have the outdoor dining together with the indoor dining, great space, well connected with the kitchen as well. Got more hidden cabinets over here. Very nice chimney and really nice touch with this light brown wood color. And sitting in the living room, you get a view of this wall all across from the other side of the house, which gives a really cool vibe to it. Really elegant, I would say. I mean, this kitchen is superb. And the thing is, working in real estate, we get to see a lot of houses. And when I say a lot, I mean a lot. And that's the beauty of our job. And when you go into houses and you see all these nice details that you like, you try to save them for later, right? In case someday you do your own renovation project or you build your own house or whatever. And for me, in this property is just full of so many nice and cool and well thought, detailed, it's impressive. I would copy so many things out of this house. I was gonna build my own house someday. Unbelievable, I tell you. It's a shame we can't show you everything. Like for example, this island has an extractor and the extractor is not installed in the island, installed in the basements to avoid any kind of noise. Or they have special extractor down at the bottom of the island for all the breadcrumbs, which is impressive. Or for example, the hangers and the bathrooms for the towels are really cool we'll see them in a sec or the wardrobes where you keep the shoes they have special ventilation for air innovation all of that is really really cool now what we're gonna do from now i'll show you upstairs three bedroom suites which are impressive and after that i'm gonna show you one of the coolest wall factors of the house which is the basement multifunction over 200 square meter amazing room you have to see it and for me, check out, coming back to the kitchen, this double Gaginau, huge fridge with double freezer. I mean, this is a fridge, right? That's the kind of level of size that you want to expect in a house like this. Wine fridge, of course. On the other side, we have the micro oven, steam oven, vacuum packer, plate heater, everything Gaginau appliances. The countertop is Decton, which is special material that holds high temperatures. I mean, this house has it all. And remember, this is a property price at 4,950,000 euros. This is not a 10 million mansion, but it could be easily compared to a property of such level because of everything that it has here, right? Nothing is missing. But what if you're cooking fish or something else smelly? Well, for that, we have another kitchen here at the back. Also completely equipped with everything that you need. That's something that any house with a modern open plan kitchen must have. You wanna be able to cook all the smelly stuff somewhere else so that the smell doesn't go inside of the house. It's common sense, right? Well, unfortunately, you not always see that. I'm sorry, but I can't stop saying how beautiful the patio is. I really like it. And we've gone round in a circle, came back to the entrance again. Next to the entrance, important, what we have is a lift that goes to all the floors and there is a guest toilet. State-of-the-art staircase. Very nice color tones, very nice wallpaper. I love the double height in the entrance. And check out what a cool view we have from this passerella onto the terrace with the jacuzzi, the golf view, I can see Gibraltar, and down into the patio where we were before. So, what do we do now? Kids bedroom or master suite? Let's start with the master. Huge space with the most impressive views. Lift comes into the master, which is a nice detail. You've got your makeup area in the entrance. Sofa space here, 
lots and lots of closet space all around. King size bed looking into these beautiful views. We've got double vanity over here, a freestanding bath in the corner which is really nice. Double shower and here's the detail, come over here, here's the detail of the towel hanger and the glass that I was telling you about that we will see here and in every single bathroom repeated, nice small detail but I love it. Of course the toilet is at the far end in a separate room with windows and the beautiful flooring that's in this bedroom and in every single of the rest of the bedrooms on this floor, it's natural wood and I think it really suits and gives a really nice contrast with all the furniture and decoration. Coming out to the terrace, I'd like to point out how all the bedroom windows have shutters with a special system that you can maneuver, which is really handy at summer because you can sleep with your windows open, put the shutters down and then they have special system which allows the airflow to go inside while you sleep. The terrace is really wide, has plenty of space and connects the master suite with the two kids bedroom at the far corner. Jacuzzi is right in the middle in the most private corner. Let's just stop for a sec and appreciate this nice use that we have over here. And on this side we have the two bedroom kids. Very practical, very nice spaces, nicely decorated with great qualities and good sized bathrooms. We've got natural marble on the walls, both bathrooms have windows, good sized closets. All the doors in the house are floor to ceiling, got great carpentry work. But most importantly, they together share this outstanding space where kids can play, do their homework, watch TV and so on. A real kids haven up here, which automatically creates a haven for you guys downstairs while kids can spend so much time up here, right? And now let's check out the basement. I promise, it's impressive. So, check it out for yourself before I say anything. Today, with so many people working from home or training from home, what could be better than this? It's like another house down here. We've got patio and terrace on both sides. This space is over 200 square meters. You've got your professional equipped gym to do a full proper workout. You've got your really nice office to work from home, away from everybody else. Beautiful, decent size. Your ping pong table for a bit of fun, right? Then you've got your sofas with a proper cinema to enjoy with your family and friends. And massive kitchen island to entertain guests or have that informal meeting with colleagues and friends. This is just something else. I mean, this space gives so much more usability to the whole property. You can spend in here weeks without the need to going out at all. I mean, you want the gym a little bit bigger, you just get the gym, you push it out a little bit more. You want a snooker table? Get rid of the ping pong table, put a snooker table in here. Or even, because down that hallway, we have two more bedroom suites with their own independent access, you could put a wall over here dividing these two areas into two different parts and you get a magnificent apartment with the two bedrooms, separate entrance, kitchen and living with the terrace and then all of this separate. But me personally, I would keep it as it is because I think this is just an absolutely unique open plan concept of living down here and it's unbelievable, amazing. I really, really love it. Now, let's get out to the terrace. Again, beautiful olive trees, same as in the entrance if you remember. The garden concept is very low maintenance, but if you want to change this into grass, you can do that in a blink of an eye, it's no problem at all. Personally though, I prefer it like this. And on this side, away from the entertainment areas, we've got two bedroom suites. They share this cozy terrace and get beautiful views even from here. Perfect for a bit all the kids that want maybe a little bit more privacy from the parents or for grandparents or any guests would love to get an invitation to stay over here. And here we access the hallway that I mentioned to you before which connects with the multifunction room, the two bedroom suites and through this door we get to the outside. We've got a big garage for at least two cars in here. There's an electric car charger as well. 
At the far end, we've got a nice laundry room with its own terrace. And through the laundry, we get to this six bedroom suite, which is currently used for staff. But if you want to use it for guests, we can switch the entrance, no problem. Out here, lots of space to maneuver. Big parking space over here. The slope is really nicely executed. A Ferrari can drive in here, no problem at all. And check out for me, have a look how the facade of the second floor comes out and overlaps the ground floor. That's what gives such a nice character. And last but not least, at 200 meters from the house, we have two 18-hole golf courses. We have an international school for kids. We have a food shop and even an organic cafe that opens at breakfast, lunch and dinner. All that at an easy walk from the house. Talk about commodities at the doorstep of your property. And that's it. This is one of my favorite houses under 5 million euros of all time. I really enjoyed it. Villa Hearts, now you've seen it completely. And guys, one of the reasons that we did this tour was because of all your comments on our previous videos. So don't stop writing, don't stop putting your input into this. Write all the comments, we'll read them and let me know what you prefer, the music video or the property tour for Villa Heart. we've done both. So let me know and of course don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, it's an amazing pleasure to do this and I'll see you soon.